Welcome to another Air Dorn video. This one covering flight in a PA-30 Twin Comanche with an automatic 3B autopilot that has just been repaired. I've had issues in the past with, with pitch functions um, in the autopilot that they've been unreliable, but I just got a recent repair that really have, uh, have cleaned up a lot of the issues that I've had. All the features and functions now work, so I thought I'd do a video and break out. Specific to the autopilot, here's what I'm doing in an IMC flight. Enjoy. Oh, I forgot to tell you one more thing about this video. The first thing I'm going to do is show you a couple of pictures. Just take a second um, of the autopilot malfunction itself. It's the amplifier in the back. It's in the tail. I'll show you a picture of that. And most telling was the card that they took out of that amplifier. It has what they call griplets. And you'll see a picture in just a moment. Um, I've had all those griplets resoldered and the connectors on the end of that card fixed. And that was the fix. I'm willing to talk you through that process. Um, it, it might or might not help you in the future, but that's what it was, and I'm excited about it uh, for now. I hope it lasts, but so far, so good. Power's good, RPMs are good, airspeed is alive. Cross checked, 80, she wants to fly. Keeping a ground effect. Gear up. Trying a different view on the Aspen. Old school. 500, 25 square. Three Delta Fox, try and contact full of departure. Over to Philly, three Delta Fox, thank you. Delta Fox, three 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 Philadelphia, A33, Delta Fox, climbing one for two. If you see the Fox, put up a torch with a contact, you can climb and maintain 4,000. 4,000, A33, Delta Fox. Four set. Right pump off. Left pump off. Three thousand, four thousand, out to select. Yeah, I have a down indication on the pitch trim, even though I selected four thousand. That's not having any impact. Three point five for four. Are good. Comes four thousand.
training watch the temps fuel pumps on right to the aux left to the aux indications are good pressure is good right pump off left pump off start the transfer for the cells Okay, so the trim indicator I was told would function as soon as the roll came on. It doesn't appear to be the case in this system. But once I turned that on, it captured the altitude. It seems to be doing okay. Okay, so I'm just I just got cleared down to three thousand. So just for kicks and giggles, this has never worked, but I'm gonna just to try it. What I'm gonna do is disconnect the altitude select and then start a pitch I'm gonna set this at three and then start the pitch down. And then re engage that. I think that's how that works. I've never done it because it has never been good enough. Um I've tried it, but it's never worked. So here we go. Disengage. Pitch down worked. Oh, that's exciting. That is just crazy. Now I'm going to re-engage that and see what it does. It's aggressive. <laughs> it works, but it's aggressive. So I have more functionality there. But it's still 1968. 3.6 for 3. It's still 1968. So if, if you tell it to go altitude pre select, <laughs> I probably have to get, um, if Ken Thompson was still around, he would go in here, take the plate off, and adjust the pot so it wouldn't be so aggressive. But I'm not worried about that. I have a pretty good procedure going for me. Otherwise. So he knows I'm going to do the procedure turn, so I'm good there. I'm pretty fast. But I think I'm pretty far out. I'm 12 miles to go, so 3.5 for 3. That's cool, though. At least, <laughs> at least it wants to work. That's a very positive, very positive thing. Complain about today's technology at all. Right, pitch level, gauge, just capture. Okay, fuel pumps are on. Right to the mains, left to the mains. Indications are good. Right pump off, left pump off. Increase the mixture a little bit. One mile to go. Disconnect the autopilot, set it to two.
And it's, uh, I was just double checking that it was 2,000 feet inbound and outbound it is. 2.5 for two. Three Delta Fox Tower report cancellation of IFR at this frequency or landline to follow. Need to do it two miles before that, and I got another seven miles to go. I'm squawking BFR. I'm down here on the comm. Back to synthetic vision. I do approaches with uh, no flaps. No way I'm properly configured on the way out. I don't need them. I can drop them in once I get get closer in and get the speed within range. But the autopilot needs 130 miles per hour, which is above the flap speed. So, based on that, I just haven't bothered. Descent in seven seconds. One dot above, at glide slope intercept, the gear come down. Bring it back a smidge. Delaware Park, Twin Comanche, six mile final, runway two two, full stop. Del Coastal. Flight slope intercept. Flight slope has captured. That's very good news. You're down green. Or Coastal Twin Comanche, short final, 2-2. Coastal Twin Comanche, short final, 2-2. Two, two. 